So we're here, we're going to be watching Possibilities Are Endless, a movie about a musician who loses some brain functionality and recovers, you know, just a oh, what upbeat, we're exciting, oh. cheery romp through, uh, okay. yeah. After the movie is over, let's not make it too long, okay? I okay. gotta go home. Yeah, okay? I think we both gotta get to bed. I gotta get to bed hour ago. The first movie, the dogs, yeah. boy, I tell you. No good. Don't go in there. Okay, well, it's don't, over. I don't think I can see it. Don't push me. Knock You're me not down. Walking. I don't care. You're walking the aisle. I don't want to walk. It. Hopefully, you can make your way through the rest of this movie, which seems a little less uh, less controversial. But maybe you'll fall asleep during it. But at least you'll stick it out I the whole way through. You will fall asleep. Trust me. If you fall asleep, you gotta. Yeah, no, I don't think I, a little bit. I think falling asleep in a movie is a great. Yeah. It's a nice. It's, a nice, it's like falling so. asleep in a Let car. Me ask you I don't have a ticket to this because I didn't know at first you were going, so I only got two tickets. Okay. So How old is that? We're just gonna. We're just gonna take a nap. Leave him out here. We're just gonna yeah. nap in there, right? How long is the movie? I don't know, like an hour and a half. I mean, most of these. Oh are my god, half. that's that's it's that's long. torture. Yeah. An hour and a half, long movie, but a nice long nap. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay. So. When is it? Where where it plays? <laughs> where what uh, where, what theater over there? <laughs> I'm gonna go sit down. I think it's in theater two. Where is that? Theater um, two is. It's theater three. That's theater two. There. We got a few minutes. No, I want to go with that. Talk, talk, mm -hmm. what, just talk freely. Talk about something what else. Ask Simon something you can ask. Have you, I like uh, to just get the conversation together. Have you enjoyed any of the refreshments here at the theater? I didn't buy anything. Yeah. Did you Did you steal anything? Too expensive. I steal anything and I don't steal. All right, good. Um, we went to Panera's and we went to just around here and I just took a short nap. Yeah, but my problem that. is I got to get up and be at work six story. Yeah, that's early. That's very early. What are you doing? Uh, I forgot to turn the microphone. It's okay because your mics are on, but now, hold on, I gotta be ready to sync them. Now I'm syncing again the intro for the possibilities are endless. Okay, well, no big deal. We're gonna watch the possibilities is endless and it's about musician who losing something. Right, whatever. yeah, something. We'll see what he loses. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it's his keys, <laughs> maybe it's functionality in his brain. I have no idea. We'll see, we'll see what happens. Really, it'll just but, be an adventure. But I know I'm not going to lose a sleep. Yeah. That's, <laughs> oh, I see what you did there. Time to go watch the movie? Yes. Time to go uh, entertain ourselves? Oh, maybe fall asleep? Up. We'll be right back after this message. Hi, I'm not Mike. And I'm not Jay. And this is not Half in the Bag, because we don't have any movie reviews or funny sketches for you to watch. So go watch Half in the Bag. You go first. <laughs> uh, I wasn't a huge fan. Kinda, I felt like I was watching the beginning of a movie for the whole movie. Yeah, I like the water, the scenery more than anything else. But it was kind of like a storytelling to a kid, you know. And it was okay. I didn't care that much. I wouldn't go see it. Yeah, Did, I felt it felt like. Especially the beginning it was kind of artsy for the yeah. sake of being artsy. It seems like an interesting story. This seems like the guy had a hard kind of something bad happened. He recovered. It's interesting, but so it told the story of a musician, Edwin Collins, who had some sort of brain hemorrhage and couldn't speak. Spent a while in the hospital and his recovery and how he used music to get back. And it was an, you know, that was, it was kind of told by him and his wife. I think imagine it was his wife. Uh, and how they went through this recovery. And the story was interesting theoretically. I just I just found it pretty slow and drawn out and, and it seems like the kind of thing that I would maybe read an article about. But the movie just kind of made me sleepy. And I think it made I you did. sleepy. Like I really did. sleepy. <laughs> <did>. Yeah. Because <laughs> It wasn't excited. No, it was not. There was no excitement. There, it was no energy. No. Um, man, I should give one. Can I go back, change? I don't Never think mind. so. It's okay. Uh, it's okay. Like, it was like a little story. Say, oh, you know, honey, once upon a time, you know, it was this guy who, you know, this happened, but it was not. 
It's not my kind of movie. No, I completely. Uh, that's what I've been telling you, everybody. It's not the movies they used to make. It's not like my big fat Greek wedding. I've been saying this and I sound like broken uh, yeah, record. Yeah, yeah, a little bit. It didn't do nothing for me but put me to sleep a little yeah, bit. <laughs> I noticed. And I don't make fun of the guy. It's just... It's, it, you know, it was no energy. Like, it wasn't there. I understand the story they were trying to tell. I just think it took, you know, an hour and a half to story to tell a story that probably could have been told in 15 minutes. I I say 10. So, oh. so even at the beginning, it was the, the voiceover of scenery that I guess was supposed to kind of evoke his journey to being a... A musician, and then the Let me tell water you something. There is nothing to describe. Overall, I didn't like it. Well, that's it. Well, so the the kind of story arc was started with him the very beginning on Conan O'Brien. I'd never heard of this band, but I guess they got reasonably oh, yeah. big. Yeah, I saw Conan O'Brien yeah, there. He what there. he was doing there? Well, it was the the guy's band was on the show. Oh, yeah. So kind of establishing him as a, you know relatively yeah, famous yeah, yeah. and successful yeah. musician. Then you go back to his start and right, it kind of right, shows right. his story from a right, boy to right, become a musician right. by having him give this voiceover on top of scenery evoking oh. his childhood and actors, I guess, who are kind of portraying who what his journey as a childhood and interspersed with the kind of weird oceany imagery of him drowning, I guess, in his illness, which kind of made sense, but also was kind of weird. And then transition to the second half, which I liked better when we were actually hearing from him and hearing from his wife and seeing them as people and not this kind of weird artsy voiceover that they provided of, of him with the scenery and the seagulls flying over an open field with the sheep and the you know artsy boy. It just got... I don't know. I wanted to, if I wanted to hear a story from him, seeing him interact, and I think when we got there, it was definitely more interesting, although still pretty pretty slow. But at least things were happening. You could tell he was progressing. But the beginning just felt like they were doing the introduction to a movie for 45 minutes and never I, got. I gave him three. Three. Yeah. On the little tear. Well, you, you, I gave him a two. Yeah, I felt like give two. I feel. Like I, actually, I want to give one. Well. Why but, didn't you? Uh, I don't know. I yeah, was well, tired. <laughs> you blew it. I think it's time to go to bed. Two oh, hours ago. No. Time for bed? Yeah. Yeah. Time for bed. That sounds sound good. good. Yeah. yeah, it sounds good. That's it.